I'm George. Welcome to our TechRap UK facility here in Birmingham. So today I'm going to be filming a full installation video using TechRap Mossy Green. So the first thing we're going to show uh, is the rear quarter panel called the rear fender also in the USA. So I'm going to show you the step by step. So we're starting with cleaning, very important step, the masking and uh, how we start the panel wrapping. Yeah. So. the full side so you can see this is the color this is the HD version so it's got the paint liner at the back also uh, very important you guys keep in mind if you cut panels by panel please remove the protective layer so you won't create any tunneling, tunneling until you guys are gonna apply it Cutting all the excess, make it easier for the installation. I'm gonna start cutting now the rear fender, separate it from the doors. So just mark it. So now we cut it all the, the rear fender, we took the doors out, side skirt, and now we're gonna start applying it. Uh, I'm gonna remove the, the protection because it's very stiff, you can't stretch it with it, so I'm gonna remove it and be very careful when we squeeze it. now to start the rear fender I always like to start from the top here peeling the, uh, the liner bit by bit so it actually keeps in position I don't want it to move we double checked this is a place is right so I'm gonna show you so I'm gonna get the cutter and slit just uh, the liner from behind a relief cut around this area so I like to finish all this so pushing the vinyl a little bit inside Okay, so now we got to the recess here, so we have to be very careful, try to fit the vinyl in, don't overstretch it to push it in, okay? So I'm gonna show you. So, I'm gonna have to lift it all the, all the way back. 
pass our finger on the counter first. I'll feel a little bit more of the, of the liner, get the squeegee. And you come from one side. Don't force the vinyl, keep it lifted. And you go bit by bit inside so you don't force it. I know uh, a lot of guys had the uh, issue with this recess. And try to just take the vinyl slowly, slowly inside. some heat all around the um, edge to relax the vinyl. I'm not stretching this, I'm just relaxing, I'm just holding it to cool down. Okay, so again I'm gonna cut it slightly shorter all around. I'm gonna heat it again so that this edge will be relaxed and not stretch. So you can see there's no tension, so then we can let it cool down, pass our finger again and trim it. I, I always trim it exactly on behind of the edge, so I'm going to show you this side. So I always cut the top pillar straight, so now we have to apply some heat on the top corner and then twist a little bit, giving the shape. Yeah. So here, the bottom, we need to tuck the vinyl quite deep inside, behind the, the front fender. It's very visible, so I'm going to show you how to do it right. I'm going to cut like a couple of like a centimeter or so. Maybe I'll push it behind it. Apply some heat. cut around the trim and tuck the vinyl under the rubber so show you for tucking I'm gonna use this micro squeegee so I'm gonna show you how so we just lift the vinyl a little bit put one of them behind the rubber with the end and keep keep the blue one moving and with the with the red one we're actually pushing the vinyl in. So top corner, bottom corner and then do the rest, yeah? Okay, so 
so we're gonna go take the vinyl on the interior so we're gonna always start with the corners so top corner bottom corner and then we stick the rest finished laying down the panel do the cutting is is very important we do the post heating all the edges over 100 degrees so get yourself a digital thermometer and check it so now we completed the rear fender so now you can guys can check take your time to take the file under the rubbers uh, go that little bit over so you can hide all the original color. Mm -hmm. 